Hello everyone, my name is Tim McAloon and I'm Professor of Sustainable Product Service Systems at the Technical University of Denmark. I'm addressing you in this video from a few different roles. Firstly, it's my honor to address you as the current president of the Design Society, the community to which the majority of the conference delegates belong. If you're not yet a member, let me extend a warm welcome to you to consider becoming a part of our community. I've been president since August 2019, meaning that over half of my term has been under the current pandemic conditions, which have been challenging to say the least. Extremely difficult decisions have had to be made by each and every one of us. And in the Design Society's Board of Management, we've been busier than ever to ensure that our community both sticks together and grows in terms of support and communication with each other, despite the pandemic and the restrictions on our abilities to meet. I must say, I'm extremely encouraged to experience the innovativeness, the flexibility and the willingness of all of our 800 plus members to create webinars, online chat fora and online workshops to compensate for not being able to meet face to face. My second role in this address is as program committee member of this conference, which I've had the true pleasure to be a member of now since 2014. The design conference is one of the most wonderful venues for collaboration, sharing and extending our informal network. This year, we get to be in our own venue, each and every one of us. Our informal network is being substituted, at least temporarily, by a social networking mechanism. But our level of sharing will remain high. I'm convinced of that. The Zagreb team, led by Dorian and Mario, has once again shown how to combine deep professional competency in organizing the conference for the 16th time now with their dynamic capabilities of adding innovative twists and charmingly personal touches, even in the light of an emergency situation, such as the one we're in at the moment. I'd say that the only reason that one of us may not get the most out of uh, the conference this year would be that we didn't put the last effort in ourselves. You, the delegates, have already been fantastic. We've been encouraging and practicing an increasing level of scientific rigor in the contributions to design for the past three or four conferences now. And the quality simply shows. And on top of that, many of you have already prepared your presentations as video pitches so that we can focus our time during the conference on the topics and on discussing the topics during the sessions. Thanks for your flexibility. And remember that with a slight amount of extra effort, this will be a memorable conference for its own special characteristics and it was despite us being at a distance from one another physically. Finally, I get the chance to address you as a fellow conference delegate and Design Society member. I must say that the Design Conference is one of the most enjoyable conferences that I've ever experienced. And I know that I share this sentiment with very many of you. It's the mix of the topic of design science that we love, the sub themes that define our community and the conference, and the community itself, which compri comprises each and every one of us that make it so special. I really look forward to engaging with you in a workshop, to sparring with you in a discussion, and to meeting you on the virtual conference balcony for a coffee and a chat. Welcome to Design 2020. Welcome to the Design 2020, the 16th edition of our event, the most peculiar one. We can also frame it as the first of this kind for a more positive note. The disruptions we all share since February provided us with the new circumstances and challenges. For the organizing team, this conference will be remembered as the one that requested the most prolonged preparation the numerous adaptations and the most unknowns we have ever faced. We know we are not alone in this. And the, with the background of pandemic, we are all experiencing the unknowns and adaptations in our everyday lives. I want to thank you personally 
for being with us today. We are all used to technology and changes. For those interested in design, it is a part of life. Nevertheless, this ability to change has not been tested on such a level in such a short time and on the global scale for several generations. This urgency for adaptation, whether to pandemic, ensuing recession, or developing crisis of climate change, should serve as a constant source of encouragement in our field. Design is about change, and today we are challenged to foresee, to research, challenged to design, to realize, to accept, to adopt, and we are challenged to adapt. Although extreme in its form, this need for change is a fitting background for the online Design 2020 conference. On the forefront, we just hope to have a successful conference. Then this notion presented us with one of the first challenges. How to measure success? What is a successful online conference at all? Hopefully, the technology will work as planned. As always, some parts of technology will not behave as expected. But we will adapt and learn from the hiccups. The technology covers only a small piece of success, although without it, Design 2020 would not happen. The success of Design 2000 online depends in the end on you, the participants. Design conferences have always been about coming together to learn, connect and discover. They are about challenging and evaluating our work in design research and in, as well as in, in its applications. It is about sharing the knowledge and experience. This spirit of exchange should not be diminished by the fact that we are unable to meet in person and are discussing from our offices, living rooms, backyards, or coffee places. Your proactive discussions, your insights and perspectives will turn this into a successful event and make a difference between a memorable experience and one that fades quickly. This is your challenge now. Make the Design 2020 an event you will remember. In behalf of the program chairs and the organizing team, thank you for your support. Thank you for staying with the conference, postponed and turned to online by circumstances. And thank you for your participation. We miss not seeing you in Southampton. The new online conference is in front of us. We made what is needed to ensure a successful design conference. Now it's handled to you. Thank you.